In aviation, we don't have stop signs as we do in automobiles, but we have these, runway hold position markings, which is what most pilots, including myself, call a hold short line. These lines are a set distance from the center line, and they vary depending on the type of aircraft the runway is intended to serve. At this small regional airport here, the hold short line is approximately 150 feet away from the center line. And here's a larger international airport that serves aircraft with much larger wingspans. Here the hold short line is approximately 280 feet from the center line. So why are hold short lines important? They keep the area clear for departing aircraft and landing aircraft. If you're a landing aircraft and you're clearing the runway, the whole aircraft has to be past the double solid line. If you're landing in a towered airport and you don't know exactly where you're going, go past the hold short line. Stop and then ask ATC for a progressive taxi. When exiting the runway at a controlled airport, you do not need ATC clearance to go past the hold short line. If you stop on that line and a part of your aircraft is protruding past it, guess what? The aircraft behind you on short final gets to do a go around. And if at an uncontrolled field, cross that line before saying clear the active. If approaching the runway and you're given the instruction hold short of runway one, you would stop on the side with a solid double yellow line. That's all. Thanks for watching.